last few years, in December, I've made year-end videos where I selected my favorite horror film of the year. And recently I thought, why stop at just picking one movie for 2022 or 2021? Why not go all the way back to the year 2000 and go year by year deciding all the best horror movies of the 21st century? While other people may have waited until 2024 to execute this idea in order to have a clean top 25 list, over here at Horror Flicks with Nick, we are simply too impatient to wait any longer. So today, I will be deciding my favorite 24 films from the past 24 years. And the rules are simple. I will pick one honorable mention, and then one top film from every year this century. One from 2000, one from 2001, one from 2002, you get the picture. Some years were easy, and some years were nearly impossible to pick just one. I'm looking at you, 2007. I'm certain this list is going to make some people mad. I can already guarantee I excluded some people's favorite movie ever. If you're a big fan of The Strangers, The Conjuring, A Quiet Place, or 28 Days Later, I'll just let you know ahead of time they didn't make the cut. And hey, if you want, you can save some time and get started typing out your angry comment right now. While you're doing that, I'm going to begin my video. Without any further ado, here are my 24 favorite horror films from the years 2000 to 2023. In 2000, my honorable mention is Cherry Falls. My favorite is Ginger Snaps. In 2001, my honorable mention is Dagon, and my favorite is Pulse. In 2002, my honorable mention is The Ring, and my favorite is Cabin Fever. 2003, my honorable mention is Dead End, and my favorite is High Tension. 2004, my honorable mention is Dawn of the Dead, and my favorite is Saw. 2005, my honorable mention is House of Wax, and my favorite is The Descent. 2006, honorable mention Them, my favorite, Slither. 2007, honorable mentions are Wreck, and 1408, and The Mist, and 28 Weeks Later, and The Orphanage, and Dead Silence, and Paranormal Activity, and Inside, and my favorite is Trick or Treat. In 2008, honorable mention is Midnight Meat Train, and my favorite is Cloverfield. In 2009, my honorable mention is House of the Devil, and my favorite is Drag Me to Hell. In 2010, honorable mention Troll Hunter, favorite Insidious. 2011, honorable mention The Innkeepers, favorite The Skin I Live In. 2012, honorable mention Sinister, favorite Cabin in the Woods. 2013, Honorable Mention Your Next, Favorite Evil Dead. 2014, Honorable Mention Oculus, Favorite Creep. 2015, Honorable Mention The Witch, Favorite It Follows. 2016, Honorable Mention The Void, Favorite Autopsy of Jane Doe. 2017, Honorable Mention The Ritual, Favorite Get Out. 2018, Honorable Mention Revenge, Favorite Hereditary. 2019 Honorable Mention Haunt, Favorite The Lighthouse, 2020 Honorable Mention Invisible Man, Favorite Possessor, 2021 Honorable Mention Malignant, Favorite Titan, 2022 My Honorable Mention is Pearl, and My Favorite is Barbarian, and last, in 2023, My Honorable Mention is Infinity Pool, and My Favorite, up until this point, is Talk To Me. Alright, those are my top 24 films, 48 if you're counting the honorable mentions, or 55 if you're counting the 7 additional films listed in 2007 because I wasn't brave enough to make a single choice. While I'm already picking favorites, I might as well take things a step further and list the best of the best. My 10 favorite films of the 21st century, again limiting myself to only one per year. At number 10, Barbarian. At number 9, Cabin in the Woods. At number 8, Get Out. At number 7, Creep. At number 6, Cloverfield. At number 5, Trick or Treat. At number 4, Drag Me to Hell. At number 3, Titan. At number 2, Hereditary. And at number 1, my favorite movie of the 21st century is... Evil Dead. That is motherfucking right, all you deadite lovers. You can cry into your ass-shaped pillows, but Evil Dead 2013 is my favorite Evil Dead movie. 
It's better than the original, better than Evil Dead 2, better than Army of Darkness, much better than Evil Dead Rise, and for my money, better than any other horror movie that has come out in the 21st century. That just about wraps up my video listing the best 24 horror movies from 2000 to 2023. Sorry if it got a little hostile there towards the end. I just thought I'd preemptively start arguing against the imaginary comment section below. Speaking of arguing, do you disagree with any of my choices? For example, should Let the Right One In have made it in over Cloverfield? Should The Babadook have been the choice for 2014 over Creep? Let me know in the comments below. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, Horror Flicks with Nick. Once a week, I post early horror reviews, horror lists, commentaries, deep dives, and two-minute recommendations for underrated horror movies you can stream on Netflix, Prime, and Shudder.